hello guys this is Asif and in this YouTube video tutorial we are going to see how we can flash back a table not a database not a table space or not an index but flash back a table so let's see and how we can do it so first of all we will verify whether our database is in flash back mode or not select flash back on log mode from either dollar to database so yes that means our flash database is in flashback mode now we will create a user create user as if identity find by as if default table space users temporary table space stamp quota unlimited on users so user has been created grant create session create session Create table to assist. Now we will connect with this user. Uh, but before that, we can check the current uh, SCN number. Select current SCN current SCN from dollar database. So our current SCN number is this one. We will just save it somewhere. Then we will connect with our zip, our zip password. We will create a table whose name is EMP. EMP number table has been created we will enable row movement on this table so we will say alter table emp we enable row movement row movement has been enabled it is necessary to enable the row movement for, uh, for performing a flashback uh, recovery on this table so we will insert a single command single value insert emp use 0 into emp and use is control 0 we will commit it and connect with this TPA to check the current uh, log sequence number so current log sequence number on the insertion of one row is this one so we will save it So on the insertion of a single row, the value of current SCN is this one. So here we have got one row. Then we will connect with a save. 
set another row also commit and then we will check the SCN number again SCN number now on two rows this is our SCN number two rows now what we will do connect with connect OSIP OSIP delete EMP two rows have been deleted so we will commit it and now we will connect we will verify whether there is any row from EMP or not there is no row so now we uh, we are in a position where we can flash it back so we will connect with this dba and CN now we have got two SCN here there was only one row so I will just copy it and see if any row has returned so you can see on zero now we I will flash big table EMP to to CN second one so now if you see it's direct from EMP now you can see that table has been flashback so that's not necessary so uh, this is how a flash pick on a table on a single table works so, uh, this was just a demonstration you can uh, uh, customize it as uh, as you wish and uh, uh, this is although this is uh, i have used flash pick table emp to scn you can also specify two time here so it will uh, flash back any particular table to particular uh, time so this uh, this was all about in this video and uh, we are going to continue with the next uh, next video in which we are going to see how we can configure recovery manager that's it